Hey everybody, welcome back to Eden Star, and um, things have changed a little bit, so you don't spawn at your Eden Star anymore. There are these new things that you have to build, and so it's asking us where do we want to deploy, and I'm trying to remember, is where are, is it here? North Point? Echo Drop, Omega Bay, or South Rim? Uh, let's go with Omega Bay. Yeah, so this is where we start off. So we could we could get back to things if we need to. Wait, is this a brand new game? Or is this... Oh, this better not be a brand new game. It's kind of reminding me of a brand new game. Uh-uh. Well, we got some plasma fire and stuff. Um, someone made a really good point. Is when you die... You drop a pack with you, um, with your stuff in it. So if we go back to our other base, we should be okay. We should have stuff in the pack. So that's where I'm gonna. Uh oh, that's where I'm gonna work my way now towards. Is there stuff coming after us? I hope not. The game looks better too. I'm not sure what's maybe different about it. There's just something that looks decent about it. Ooh. Let's go get this. Maybe there's some ceramic up here as well. There we go. Turn our light on so you can kind of see what's going on. Yes, okay. Yeah, so you can kind of see where our two Eden Stars are still there, so I'm glad we didn't have to reset the game. Um, but until we build those things, we won't be able to spawn near our bases. Which I understand. They're trying to expand things so that your Eden Star isn't the one-all, be-all kind of thing. So that's pretty cool. Uh, let's run this way. I'm thinking that there might be some stuff up here for us to check out. Yes, there's some more ceramics up there. I've never noticed this one before, so this one might be new. The ceruleum. I'm really up to the ceramics. There was a reason for it. I... Oh, there's one right there now, too. Been playing this so sporadically that it's just hard to keep up with my trail of thought. But I remember dying last time, and that was not good. But if we can get our backpack back with all the stuff in it, that's great. But usually, as I explained to the, the commenter, is I usually fall off the edge of the world. Which explains why I wouldn't have my stuff on me. Wait. Oh, so yeah, there's our Eden Star. I was like, wait, why is there a beam coming out? Because there's a giant Eden Star in there. So that's roughly where we died. Just trying to remember how to get over there again. I guess we'll do this. Try to... Nice. Sprint up the wall. Is that right? Yes, okay, here it is. Oh, sweet. Boingy. So many cool discoveries. Go in here. So it should... I think this is where we died, isn't it? Save us, Tom Cruise! Yeah, so until... Until those things can be defeated... We're not going to be off to a good start. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Um, what am I doing? Armory. There we go. Can we build a pistol? We need some ironite. That's our problem. We got everything else, though. Ceramic and stuff like that. Um, we got our energy blade. I just don't remember where I died. Died. That's part of the problem. 
Uh-oh. And we died. Well, this will tell us, because we know exactly where we died this time, where to go. How did we survive three days? I'm really confused. Ugh. This is frustrating. Wait, 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 wait. We're not starting over, are we? Oh, because we didn't have a respawn thing. Well, give me a second. Not only am I going to check where I died in the last episode, but I'm going to reload the game. So BRB. Oh, nice. There we go. Trying to get Ironite. Yeah. This is a great way of getting plasma fire. I don't know if I ever want to get rid of that. Haha. Ha. Oh, this probably has some Ironite in it. Don't attack me. That would be great. I will take your plasma fire, though. Good call. Hmm. So one thing I did learn about when uh, crafting now is that if you do a foundation, you can, like, drag it, I guess? Up and down a little bit, so that's cool. I don't know if you could do that before. I don't think you could. I think that was something they were talking about. That was a little frustrating. You saw how frustrating that was for me. Uh, great. Not a lot of Ironite. Come on, hook a brother up. There we go, there's five. I don't think that backpack's there. I'm pretty sure I died, like, right next to where that rock is. It's just gone. I, like, ran straight out and got, died because of the radiation. So that's not great. But I do want to look up. What we need to build in order to respawn. Is it in this menu? Okay, so we got a lockbox. Yeah, replication kit. So we need 20 ironite, 20 fiber, protonite, and ceramic. Oh, great. So we need 25 ceramic. So you're going to need to actually get that before you can even settle anything. That kind of sucks. And ceramic is not easy to come by. Thank you, game. May I have another? <laughs> okay. So we're good on Ironite. We need to just go find the ceramic and the ceruleum and stuff again. Oh boy. How fun is that? How fun is that? Alright, so we know where to go. We saw it earlier. We saw it earlier. There we go. Alright. So none over here. Are you? No, okay. There we go. Get it. Nom nom nom. So we're probably gonna want to use that over at our other base actually. So there's really no reason for us to hang out here anymore. Head back to our other base. The Juggernaut is also in the game now, which is like a boss type creature. So that could be interesting. If we run into him without a weapon. So we'll see what happens. Um, don't remember where that other... That 
other block was. We had a yeah, I think it was this direction. Let's see. Special weather statement. Real life. I'm always getting in the way of gaming. Um, hmm. What's above this hill? I don't think I've ever gone this way before. Oh, oh. Oh, gosh. No, thank you. I've also learned that um, certain creatures don't come until you're bases at a certain level, which I think I qualify for. Oh, I see. I didn't see you. That's where he was coming from. Oh, wow. What the heck? It just blew up. And something just said 20% ceramic. What the heck? Really? Who just blew up? I don't care who it was. I'll take it. Bounce. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? It's a whole wall of ceramics. Where you at? There we go. Come on, get him. Come on. Back up. Nice. Oh, there's another one. Uh, yeah. Nice. Come on, one more. One more good blast. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Nice. One big chunky piece of plasma fire. I like it. I had no idea that this wall existed. It's not gonna exist when I'm done with it. <laughs> it's just gonna be an hour of me doing this. Wow, that's cool. I'm not going back up there for that piece. Sorry. I get all the ceramic I can get though. Nice. So I'm pretty sure um, and in a future update, the map is going to change too, which will obviously require a reset. I feel like we've maximized a lot of different strategies for this particular map. So I'm feeling pretty good about a change. This is also a multiplayer game. I have not done that experience yet. So that could possibly change the way the game is played too. Oh, and it seems like in multiplayer too that when your, your character goes to sleep, they're just open to the elements. Kind of like Rust and a couple other games. I've been doing that for a while. It's just kind of a trend, I guess, that people want. I'm personally not a big fan of it. Imagine if like Minecraft was like that. It'd be kind of annoying. I'm sure there's actually a mod for that. If not, there should be one. People won't like that kind of stuff. Oh, so much ceramic. I'm gonna keep track of nightfall here. Where are we at? Okay, so we're like not quite the middle. A wall of ceramic. Wow. I did not know this existed. Maybe this is brand new. I don't know. Don't get too close to that thing. When we get to a hundred, I'll be happy. Store everything, or with we're gonna have to go soon because I actually don't know how far we are from our other base in terms of running to get there. I say right at four, we're gonna have to go. Oh, there's so much ceramic down here, don't let it go to waste. Okay, 10 seconds. to turn around. We gotta go. Yeah, we gotta run that way. Am I sprinting? I say there's no way I'm sprinting. Come on. 
We can get home. I certainly hope I'm headed the right direction. Is that right? Yeah, it is. Just seems really weird. But regardless, it's a home. <laughs> if it's the wrong one, it'll keep us protected. So this should allow us to build... Yeah, this is the right one. This should allow us to build the replication unit, which would be nice. You know what? We've got plenty of time to get back. Let's stop and get some of this to null. But uh, the other thing, too, I think, is that it said if you do fall off a cliff, there's a good chance that your backpack might survive, too, like just on the edge of the cliff. So that's nice. So we'll just have to wait and see what happens there. I do kind of want to actually get inside before things really hit the fan. And get some fiber. Come on. Come on, tree. Come on. Get that fiber. With one hour to go, I really have to book it. Come on. Seems like this process takes a lot longer than it used to. It's kind of weird. Came around. Give me my tree. Give me the tree. Oh, yeah. So this is kind of like starting over. We had to kind of find our place in the world and do all that st fun stuff. Give me some of this. Well, it's time to regenerate. Come on. Okay, jump, jump. Very nice, and we're in. Okay. Okay, so we need a lot more fiber and a lot more protonite, and uh, we have uh, very little ironite. That's six. And the only thing that's in here is this stuff. Shoot. That's all right. That's all right. It is what it is. So I think before the bad guys get here, I think that's probably going to end it for this episode. Uh, next episode, we'll obviously try to build that and just keep on keeping on. So until then, this is JPT. As always, go play your games, and I'll be seeing you.